the throne of God. Mm. And she was the only missionary I saw up there who, when she talked about her trials, and she had the most horrible thing I can imagine, stacking the bodies of babies mm. and looking for fire. It's just like that hit me hard. And just seeing that even in that, she was joyful and that she was serving the Lord. Mm. And I think that was that was neat for me because she really has the heart of Jesus. Mm. Because even all the other missionaries, when they got up there to share, when they talked about their trials, they were mournful, which isn't a bad thing at all. But she truly had that beacon of light. Mm. And I think that when she talked about the baton, that made it all more powerful. Yeah. Because she truly has that joy about serving that many of I mean, I wish I had that mm. flame to serve, you know, it's awesome. Yeah. And so I think it made her just so much more impactful mm. you know, for everybody. And you will hear pretty much everybody that, that baton and everything is just resonating throughout, yeah. you know, throughout this place. And it's, it's, you know, and then seeing the other pastors in there, even in their mournfulness, they are still looking to God to see what they're doing. Um, you guys heard of it, just announced that we're starting a podcast. Yeah. So it's, it's really cool. cool. That's my uh, high and low. Yay! I love my family.